Hi guys and welcome to Ivy's Coupon Camp and today we are doing our 31 days of Halloween and I want to start it off with this. This is the first thing we made. Everything from Dollar Tree. Nothing is from anywhere else this video, okay? So for day one, 31 days of Halloween, if you want to see what's going on, hit subscribe guys like it and then after the video drop a comment because that's what keep the videos coming please drop a comment and please share 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 after you subscribe so let's get it going okay guys so let's go over the items that you will need now i'm going to be stepping in and out of the camera but i'm going to start going through the items that you will be needing okay the first thing you'll need is these hats right here they came from Dollar Tree, of course, they were a dollar. I bought three of them, okay? I wish I would have got more. If I go back to that Dollar General, uh, Dollar Tree, I will, okay? Next, these are just little spooky novelty bags, and they draw. They draw in you. Okay? And they just have, like, some had the spooky face on and some did not hopefully this face this is different so like i said about four of those one was one you saw these are nothing but ring spiders that's all they are different ones these are a bag of regular just spiders um which come in ha handy for all the crafts that you do for halloween then guys you'll see that you have um some webbing we got we have purple and we got some green I have a spooky bow and leaves from my collection of fall DIYs that I done, okay? So all we do, basically, let's refurbish our thing. So now what I use for stuffing was just regular pad paper. You can, guys, use um, Philly polyfill if you want to make it pillows. Um, those are actually this first set of gifts. I figure I will make those for my kids and um, let them have something special that I first made my first DIY with. So let's get it started. Let's start ripping the paper. I think I ripped about 10 sheets of this. Okay. I ripped it. I balled it up. Which, I mean, this is real easy, guys. The, the project is super easy. And you can, and I want to start off with easy ones before I get into some complicated ones that, you know, take a little measuring and stuff like that. But this is just a quick DIY. Start your, your 30 day, one days off with. Stuff it like a bag. That's all. You can stuff it with polyfill. Um, I've stuffed them with t-shirts before. Different items that I've stuffed it with, okay? Um, it just depends on how, what feel you want to get out of it. And you can make it as fat as you want to, okay? That's not a biggie. Make it as big as you want to make it. Okay, once you get it stuffed, guys, this actually comes with two drawstrings on the side. That's all you do. What I did was tie these to the back because I want to make sure you get what you that 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 is hidden now you don't have to tie it to the back okay there you go that's how you want it just like that okay so next we're going to start with our bow and i'm just going to take the bow you see i just went on ahead and took the twist ties and pushed them down of course we need our trusty e6000 that's just screwing up everywhere Put some on there, not a lot. You don't have to. E6000 go a long ways, guys. Place it right there so that it'll be kind of tacky. Place it on there so it'll be kind of tacky. Okay, I like it kind of like that. Then some of our leaves that we're going to use, take them. Glue. I will put the glue on top of this bag also and around it. And then try to glue a couple of pieces onto this just because you want to make sure that it sticks. And wham. Pumpkin come from the pumpkin patch. Um, it's it does not have to be perfect because it's a pumpkin, scary pumpkin. Okay, so kind of like do that. There you go. Now we're getting there, right? Next, let's grab some spiders. 
let's grab an orange spider this time. See, it's got that little extra leg. I just took them and opened them up. If you bend them all the way like that, then they'll stay open. Or you could put them to the front. You can make something special. It's a spooky spider. Do what you want to do with it. I took this part, put glue on it, stuck it somewhere. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. That's cute. Then, now, I want to take some of these. Because in this bag, it's different things other than a spider. Let me show you. Ah! I didn't know that was in there. So, if we make it and put a little more, some spiders probably right there. So, let's put a spider there. I just chose spiders, guys. You can choose whatever you want to. It does. It's not written in stone. That every DIY you see need to be what you what everybody else is doing. So put a spider there. Now you could take some of your webbing. This stuff, y'all know, once it come off, it's hard to woo, Jesus, it's hard to get this together. And I would just pull it, pull it a loose, like you just see me doing now, and it's getting on everything. Kind of scratch it because it goes a long ways. A long ways. And stop placing it on your spider. You want you want your little thing to look spooky, but also you want it to look fun. Okay, you just want it to be a fun little spider, pumpkin spider. Okay, now that's it. Each one of these you could make to look different, guys. Look at that. It is so cute. Each one of them you could make differently, okay? So let's get that one is done. We'll put it over there with his brother. Okay, guys. So I went and got a saw of fabric to put in one of these to show you. Now, this is a curtain I used last year for uh, Christmas. It's real big. See? See how big it is? It's huge. It's big. This, we're going to stuff with it. Let's see if we can make it in here. Okay. And I want to stuff it so that this spooky is showing. All right. Uh-oh. As you can see, don't pull it too hard. I ripped the hole in it. So let's turn it this way. But that's okay. That's good. That means it's a spooky Okay, now, the same exact thing that we did, but let's see. Okay, the same exact thing that we did. Tie it up. Okay, now. Now, that's just, you want it to be able to sit up on its own, though, okay? So, let's cover it. You don't want it to be perfect, okay? You don't want that. Let's get uh, let's get one of these, and one. Let's get so I don't, okay. I don't get any one of those. Okay, so bend the arms. Glue it. And that's fabric, so it'll stick to that real well. Let's take some more of our little spiders and glue them all around. One by his nose, because he didn't got in the spider patch. Okay, now. Take off your ticket. 
they're tagged. I like to cut them, but I didn't want to waste too much time. And then go around. Put it on there. See? Your little spider still showing. Put it on. Now, take a couple of leaves. I'm going to do a couple of, let me see, I want to make sure that shows. I don't know if I want to do some more leaves. I want to put some more spiders on there. I think I'm going to put more spiders on him because he got ruined. As you can see, it's a felt bag. It's easy to ruin, okay? Okay, he covered in spiders. That one is covered in spiders. Yuck. Okay, bag number three. There you go. Bag number three, stuffed with paper again. That's what we're doing. Okay, we have him stuffed, but we're going to kind of make him, remember, we want all of them to look different. So, I'm going to kind of make him a skinny head like that. Okay, and let's draw his head up. Because, you know, most pumpkins, some pumpkins, if you go to a real patch, they misshaped. See that? That is so cute. Okay, now, see how he's much more skinnier than his brothers and sisters. That he, We want to use some green on him. Let's do some green. Brighten it up a little. My favorite color of all time is green. So, you want to do a little green. Because they didn't... Hey... There you go. Do some green. This stuff is so... Uh, it sticks on everything. But that's okay. That's the fun of it, right? So we'll get it like this. Get it in there. Now, I always check and see how your stuff going to look. You want him to be kind of, you know... He might be their daddy. I don't know. That's their father, I think. So we want to glue this down now. Okay, now that's glued down, but you know how each 6,000, it takes a long time to dry. Should we put that, that there? He is the dad. You want something coming out of his hat. So, let's stick that in there. See that? Didn't even have to glue it, guys. You didn't even have to glue that. And then, let's stick on some spiders, okay? We'll put some spiders on. Okay, we stuck our spiders on. Now... You got to create a scene. I'm going to create just two, okay? And here's our first spider family scene, the pumpkin spider family. The, they watching the spiders have a baby. So let's create the second scene. Okay, guys, and here is our pumpkin. So you can make them into pillows. I want to show you that you could do whatever you want to do when you DIY. It's endless. As you can see, he got screwed up a little, but he actually fit. Halloween. So I hope you all enjoyed this video, guys. Tune in tomorrow for 31 days of Halloween DIY day two. Thank you. Bye.